Do you struggle to keep your back straight while sitting at the computer? Do your hands, arms and wrists hurt after long working or gaming sessions? Lucky you, we have a solution. Introducing Big Max 3000. But don't worry, I won't chop your limbs off. Just the keyboard. Oof, that was a close one. Okay, now that my keyboard is cut in half, let's see how we can position it to yeet away the pain. Let's start simple and position both halves almost together, but angled inwards. Just tilt the sides until your hands are aligned with your forearms. This position is common for beginners or small desks, and it's already a significant improvement over a traditional keyboard. Now your wrists are no longer bent outwards, one of the main reasons you felt pain while typing or gaming. Also, notice how your elbows are further away from the body, opening your chest. If you continue to split both halves, your chest opens up even more. That makes your shoulder rotate backward, helping you keep your back straight. It might seem like magic, but it's just biomechanics. A small split makes the keyboard use a lot of desk space, pushing your mouse away. If you don't like that, we have a solution. Split both halves more and place the mouse in the middle. You can also place a trackpad, or a coffee mug, or even lunch. Okay, now I'm hungry. Can you bring in the catering? What? No catering? Medium split is one of the most common setups, but you can keep going. Now try placing the halves of your keyboard in front of your shoulders. You'll instantly notice that your chest opens up and your back is now straight. In this scenario, you don't usually need to rotate the keyboard inwards. Your wrists will be naturally aligned with your forearms. This configuration uses a lot of the desk, but gives you heaps of space for your mouse in the middle. You can even place a big drawing tablet, or your pen. Okay, maybe that's too much. All that is great, but what if I only want to use one half? Let's say for gaming, or illustration, or video editing. How should I position it? Here's a simple tip for those cases. Position your mouse, trackpad, or drawing tablet where your other half was. That way, you'll avoid adopting weird positions that will start hurting after a while. Oh, and remember, when using drawing devices, be sure to pay attention to posture while watching details on the screen. It's okay to lean closer once in a while, but remember to lay back afterward. As you've seen, once you split your keyboard, a world of opportunities opens up. We recommend starting simple and slowly splitting the keyboard wider apart. But we'll also love to hear about your tips and secret postures. No, not those ones. I've seen some crazy things in our subreddit and Discord channels, so please share them in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. See you in our next video. Until then, can someone bring me some food? Mmm, thank you. <laughs> what? No catering. Uh, hold on. I mean, what? I just can't get that right. No catering? No. <laughs> no catering? <laughs> this is so hard. So this is so hard. <laughs> Bloopers. <laughs>